We are so happy today that we have here in Power Girls with a Latin twist, an example of discipline, a successful woman, the lawyer, Helen Daniel. How are you? I'm great, Vanessa. Thank you so much for having me here today. Thank you for coming and giving us this time to hear your story and hopefully get to those women, those entrepreneurs that want to start their business that, that has a goal and they're gonna listen to your story. Thank you. Well, you came to this country when you were 13 years old. That's right. You were born in France. You came with your three sisters and your mother, not knowing the language, with no money. How does an immigrant, a girl that is 13 years old, go through that? It was very difficult. And uh, uh, there were times that uh, we weren't sure we were going to make it. Uh, but I was very lucky uh, that I had my mother and my sisters uh, who surrounded, we surrounded each other with love and support, so we have a very strong sense of family. Uh, but the, uh, I had one job, my job was education. Mm -hmm. I had to work very hard in school, focus in school, and that was what I had to do while my sisters and my mom all worked very hard to support all of us. So while growing up, what do you think was the one thing that shaped your life so that you can become the woman, the successful woman you are now? Uh, discipline is really an important thing, a sense of focus, uh, certainly determination. Uh, today I hear a lot of young kids say, oh, my plan B. Uh, we didn't have a plan B. There was no such thing. Failure was not an option. And so this is why we all, all of us, work so hard. And uh, to this day we continue to, to work hard to achieve all of our great dreams. It is so nice, you know, now that you say it, just to have, to have plan A. Not, sometimes it's good to only have plan A because you just have to make it. That's right. right? That's right. And that was your, your plan. Plan A, that's it. That was our story. We only had one plan and that was to survive. And you became a lawyer. I became a lawyer. That's right. And now your plans, you have another plan. What is your new plan? Well, my new plan is I am running for circuit court judge in Hillsborough County, so I would like to become a judge and the election is in August 2020. How can they find you? I, uh, I can use all the help, of course. I welcome anybody who can help me, uh, certainly going on social media, Facebook, Insta, and Twitter, and uh, liking my page would be very helpful. And uh, also getting my name out there, passing my name around, that's very, very helpful. So yes, uh, any help you can give me, I would be very appreciative. Okay, good, well, will do. So what would you what do you think is the key of the success? Like in your life, what has been the one thing that you can say? Um, I have been very lucky, I have to say. One of the life lessons that I have learned is, uh, you know, one day you have money, one day you don't have any money. So that doesn't really matter ultimately. I think what I've learned is it's what's inside you as a person and the determination and the courage really, it is to get up every day and try again, try harder, work harder, whatever it is that you need to accomplish, really focus on that and take away all of the distractions, all of the temptations. And so one of the things that I did to get to become a lawyer uh, was to, of course, study very hard, but I really restricted myself. Uh, in not having parties, not dating, not doing all these things that might jeopardize my ability to finish school and to graduate as a lawyer and to pass the bar. So it took a long, long time. So in situations like that, when, you know, many people say, okay, you know, I cannot do it anymore. You know, it's so hard or your biggest obstacle. What can you say has yes. been? Yes, so the biggest obstacle is uh, ourselves. When we stop believing in ourselves, Vanessa, when we have self-doubt, that's our biggest obstacles in life every time. So we have to surround ourselves with people who are like us. We, have, we all have dreams and we all have to support each other with our own dreams, each other's dreams, and we, we, uh, we, we help each other get there. And so when we believe in ourselves, we can accomplish anything. And that is the mentality and the philosophy of Power Girls with a Latin Twist. We believe in each other and we support each other. That's why for us today that you're here 
is very, very special. I'm very grateful. Thank you so and much, thank Vanessa. Thank you for coming and sharing your story and your tips and, and everything and being with us today. Thank you so much, Vanessa. Thank you.